Guys, this is a exciting one. We've obviously had quite a big um, update here. Probably the biggest update we've had in a very, very long time. Now, what I want to do on this video is just give a bit of a um, quick look at everything that's come out in the update, just in case you're a player who doesn't play anymore. You, it might tempt you to come back. I don't know, but I want to give a quick review and then I want to kind of put my opinion into the void and see what you guys think. And I want you guys to comment down your honest opinions of these updates. Again, guys, I am saying... <laughs> oh, I think I'm allergic to the update. Let's start with that. I'm saying... Um, opinion so don't attack anyone because it's their opinion guys just, just chill out okay i know we're online i know everyone likes to be savage but you know <laughs> oh, i don't know what i'm talking about i'm online i'm gonna get a rinse for saying that but anyway so let's take a look we've got the main problem with this update and i'm sure everybody will agree with me if you don't i'll be very shocked is that for me this is a problem the second you load the at least put a five second delay on it or something the second you load the game up you're given these free tiers and none of these are, are reasonably priced none of them and then you see that you've got all these yesterday i came in and i had four tiers and they all had the same thing in and i'm thinking jesus that's 400 quid they're trying to get for me immediately like relax to me and it's just my opinion again when that happens that gives me two initial thoughts number one the game is dying so they're trying to rinse everybody for money quickly before they shut it off or they've just run out of ideas of updates and they're just rinsing everybody with stupid slot machines so there's two things there which i think and it's, a, it's unfortunate because i like this game it's, that's not a jib on the game i'm just saying that stop doing that so let's ignore that so we've got a new hero pass i don't think we've had a hero pass for a while actually and of course we've got a new character um he looks oddly 3d there that might mean they're changing the art style to make it um easier to do because 3d modeling is easier than 2d animation don't know if any of you knew that that's why most games would be 3D, guys. But anyway, um, what we do here, is, yeah, I don't need to go through this. It's another battle pass, guys. If you want to cop it, cop it. It's probably, yeah, same as always. Don't really care for the frame. Don't particularly care for the character. Okay, so what do we have? Because we have a lot here. And we also have some new things here as well. <sighs> and I sigh. Because... I thought this would be quite cool, but it isn't. <laughs> because I clicked, um, where was it? I clicked here and I saw that and I was like. <sighs> they couldn't have got a lower percentage if they tried. They literally, they could have done it to 1%, but no, they went 0.01. They're a menace. Like, that is crazy. I would actually love to know if anybody's ever got that. Because I highly doubt anybody has. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, again, guys. I'm just complaining about the drop rate here. And I'm complaining that we have another lucky thing. Which costs loads, mind. And this will link me back to another thing I'm whinging about. Because um, if you go into the coupons, uh, that's fine, actually. If you go into the get more so obviously i did the you you end up getting two a day which is fine because it's free um and then you can also exchange but unfortunately it's only diamonds so you know that's five thousand diamonds that's ten thousand diamonds and each of those are only 10 so you can get 30 you can basically get 30 for free um so let's so let's just pull one i haven't done a pull on this yet so i don't know what the animation is going to be like i don't know if you can pull the handle no that'd be too cool so Let's just roll it and see. It looks cool graphically, and the design team have done a fantastic job. I think it looks amazing. But let's just do a pull and see what happens.
So that wasn't too bad, actually, because that was quite a decent one. Because then I can take away four more summons there. So that's quite cool. So it's, it's not awful. But what you really want to do with things like this, guys, is not give them loads of money for getting the coupons. But take it with a pinch of salt and just do, do it free. And then there's nothing to complain about. It's just another thing that you can get, what, uh, 20, you get two a day, so you can get 24 free spins. Cool. Cool, that just means new things, guys. Awesome. Um, and then in the coupon store, you get 10 per summon. So if you do 120, you are guaranteed an elite type character, which is nice. So I complete type, which is nice because I'm trying to get two kings here. Oh, that is so much cooler. Ooh, that is sick. I'm trying to get another king so I can um, get, him, get him up that new hero thing. But yeah, so lucky slot. Pretty cool. Um, the only thing I complain about is how expensive and ridiculous it is to get coupons. But look on the bright side, you can get them for free and just, just enjoy it. Enjoy it. Fortune wheel, same as always, guys. Don't need to review this. Um, great. We've got the bosses. I, they haven't added a new boss, but these are quite cool. My guild always never fails to smash to the 30. Um, I normally tend to challenge Pluton as the one where I use, I always go in with one team being really good. So I'll use a really powerful team. So I'll do the good old one, I use my boss battles here. Nice. Because there's a chance that we can do the five attacks on, on normal attacks. Um, so if that happens on Triple Star Lily, we're going to be flying. See there, it did a couple of more hits there. Come on, hit Triple Star. Yes. Bing, bing. I'm just hoping we get a few um, good luck towards the end of the, of the multiple hits. Because then... Um... Okay. <laughs> Come on, let's, let's get some multiple hits there. I don't, I don't, I'm not getting very lucky with that special. Get triple stuff to leave boosted up. Again, there we go. Huge damage. Oh, look at the damage. Oh, I wonder if we're gonna get if we're, if we're gonna get um to 1.99. Oh, <gasps> so close. That is some good damage. Mad. Anyway, sorry, I got distracted. So this is, this is another gripe that I have, is that they didn't just merge these into one. This is a lot of money to be spending every 12 days, because if you think about it, there's never a period in this game where there isn't an update or there isn't an event going on, which sometimes I think, I think they should leave at least like a, maybe a three day gap so you could just chill. But anyway, um, that's like 26 quid and that's like 20 quid so that's like 40 quid every you're almost going to spend 80 quid a month if you did it per event which is bonkers i know you don't have to buy them but I, i'm taking the grip on it of how much this stuff actually costs and it's all for rng based stuff which is annoying and then obviously we've got the multi-mission rewards and then we've got if you get xp yeah, if you get XP, you move up. But yeah, if you get a VIP and spend, you get more stuff. I don't really care for that. I'm still saving up my bot tokens for a bot event. Will it ever happen? We don't know, guys. <laughs> we're we're going to have to patiently wait and see. And I'm getting close now to the free, um, 350 mark. I've had a lot of people say that when you hit 350, your power shoots up quite a lot. So I'm quite intrigued. But the main bit of this video, guys, is what I wanted to get into. So obviously, we've got the new character in here. And I dislike this. Um, good old Jonas dropped the message in our guild chats. Because I didn't even look at this. Um, still no way to not spend tokens, which is annoying. But I didn't even look at this. But what on earth has happened here? They've enlarged them. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake. Sorry, distraction. So, it... <sighs> It's kind of cool, 
but it takes too long and I don't care. Like, do you know what I mean? So they've got this new like 3D system. Again, it's 3D. It's easier for them to make. It's easier for, it's easier to put into the game because there's less things they need to do. Um, but anyway, so you select a row and then it picks one randomly from the row and then it falls down. There's a stupid long animation where it falls down and there's no way to skip it. And then it opens and then you get a little character. That does look cooler, mind, but does it need to take that long? Just add a skip button. Um, and then obviously, yeah, so that it looks better, but add a skip button. <laughs> I don't need to watch that happening every single time. Um, nothing's changed in here, guys. I'm going to buy another uh, character thing in there. Great. And um, that's basically all I do. I, I just go between 300, 500, 300, 500 each time. That's all I buy in this shop. But yeah, cool. Ooh, in here I can get some boxes. I want to get some. Can I get some? Yeah, I can get some more for TT in here. Actually, I want to buy a card pack. I want to buy a card pack. I want to do a little cheeky card pack opening and um see see what i get guys let's have a look where did it go here we go slice trash <laughs> great um but this is the main thing that i wanted to bring up here guys and because there are so many maintenance tweaks and issues and things shutting down and everything go why does see that keeps happening to me as well since I've done the update? Just trying to do a video. Do you know what I mean? I, I don't think I'm asking for a miracle here. Just, just oh for goodness sake! This happens to me a lot, by the way. I, I thought I thought we might just better tease for it, but I was wrong. So yeah, so the update is cool, and obviously I'll quickly take a look at the new character, then I'll quickly again in my face. I don't stop it. Ah, so I want to get a water and just ch ch stop. Ch naughty. Ah, ah. Okay, so what was I doing? Ah, yeah, this is the benefit of the update, guys. Watch. Three thousand diamonds. Every single person should get around three thousand diamonds for all of their mess ups through the update. That's brilliant. That's that's a free 10 times summon there, guys. Lovely. And obviously that's from the um, battles, um, the tournament event. But yeah, cool. So everybody should take that home. Cool. Um, so let's get back to the recruit here. Uh, so not the recruit. I want to look at the new character, didn't I? So I want to see because... And obviously... <sighs> There's too much to ram into one video. So I'm going to be going over the Spirit Hall in detail tomorrow. But this is here and it does take elite characters to use. But luckily for me, I, I just, I'm just going to put TTs into each one because I have a decent amount of backlogs of these characters, um, which is very lucky. And each one has different things. When battle begins, self-increased attack by 20% for the first active skill release, self-attack decreases. So that's probably... A really good one and i've got this one damage dealt increases 10 h increased by 10 percent and we've got at the start of each rave gain five rage so i don't really know which one to do at the moment for tt um i will think about it but it's probably just going because then we get if rage greater than 60 damage dealt increased by 10 percent when round begins because I don't actually want to know how difficult they're going to be to level up, but I, I want to continue maxing out TT. I'm trying to get TT to plus 10 as well, guys. Um, and I know that will probably rattle a lot of people, but I want to just try and get one character maxed. But I, at the moment, I, I have jumped back onto Snoop. I want to get Snoop up to plus to the next tier, then I might work on TT. But yeah, it is a bit difficult, but there we go. Attack increased. So yeah, there's loads of different things you can do, and each character has something different. So it's, it's important to kind of do a little bit of research what makes sense. Why do you use this character? But I'll dabble in that later and I'll dabble in it tomorrow. And there's a new mode as well. So again, I'll take all of that tomorrow for you guys. Um, and you can now raid special day. So I've started to just um, smash through this mode here so, so I can get to actually being able to raid special day, guys. But you have to complete it five times. So it's not an instant thing, unfortunately. It does take a few seconds to do. Um, but... It's worth doing now because, like I said, you will end up being able to get to a stage that allows you to just click a button and raid through these nice and easily. 
and that the windscreen's cooler now. So there's lots of cool things to kind of bear in mind um, as we sort of tick through this now, guys. Do that one again. So I, I've just been trying to speed run this as quickly as possible um, and not do anything properly because then, then I can unlock the, the decent speed run. So I can just start raiding through this mode, which will be really, really nice. I always like to hire someone's really overpowered lackluster because then you can just sit and just chill through the mode. Ooh, big bullet hit. So yeah, so what happens there? I'll go I'll go up to the next floor here, guys. I might as well clear the two that are next door to it, actually. Yeah. That's garbage, but I'll just put that one on. So I'm just quickly going through that. It says here, clear floor eight six times. So it is going to become a... It's not going to be an easy thing to get to straight away. But what I like is that this is kind of motivating me to get back into playing this mode because now I'm working towards unlocking something. So I think that's really cool. But you can raid that. It's going to take a couple of weeks to get there, but you can raid it now. So then obviously we've got the new character, which again, I'll go into detail in a future video, but I just kind of wanted to, to show you that we have a new character and he's luckily he's not a complete, he's not a complete type. Look at his giant head, but he's a cool character. And of course we've got this new little thing here because that's saying that he has his spirit hall maxed out. So yeah, you, and it's quite nice because it allows you to see all of this. So, which is mad. But yeah, it, it allows you to kind of get a grasp for these characters maxed out, guys. But yeah, there's the update. We've got a new mode with a new upgrading system, a new character, a new slot machine, a new RNG mode. Um, you can now raid special day after you've completed it. Probably around maybe 10 times overall you could raid through all of it, which is fantastic. I don't know how you raid it yet. I hope it's not diamonds. Considering I pay for VIP, I hope it's the VIP. But yeah, I think it's cool. We've got these new modes, new look. Everything's been sort of refreshed. And I'm excited to see what they do next now. Because this is quite a big update. And there is a new PvP mode coming. But they they messed it up. So it's just been deleted for now. And it should be brought back soon. But yeah, guys. Comment down below. Let me know what you think of the update. I'm enjoying it now. It's, it's, it's re-put me back into the game, which is awesome. And I do have 100... 1.200... I can't speak. Matt, see you later. Cool.